Hey guys, what's up? It's Bradu. I have a really fun product here. We've got a box. I guess you can call it a hobby box. 2019 Tops Gallery. It's a Walmart exclusive product. This is the art of collecting. Um, even though it's Walmart, it's basically a hobby box. It's 20 packs. <coughs> and the part I'm not, I've been opening a lot of baseball cards lately. The part I'm not used to is I should be getting an autograph tonight. Um, so I usually buy retail flagship and I never get autographs. And there's supposedly two autographs in this box. So I feel like I got a shot at something good. Even if I don't hit anything like that, as an artist myself, um, I'm really excited for these cards. Just really cool artwork. I did, I am an artist on this set, but I don't have any of the base cards, so the chances of getting one of my own cards in here are extremely, extremely slim. But it's kind of fun to be a part of it, you know. It's definitely fun. Well, let's look at the odds. So, let's see. We're supposed to get two autographs. Sketch card. Ooh, ooh. One in, I was going to say a few hundred. One in 3,341. So that's the chances of getting one of my own artwork cards. Only divide that by... 10-ish, because, no, more than that, divide that by 50, probably, <laughs> because there's many other artists who did a lot more cards than I did, but my artwork is in the set, so that's fun. I'm going to do this a little bit backwards. Uh, most people would open the regular packs first. I'm going to open the gallery box loader first. Look for original paintings, I I don't think this is an original painting. It doesn't feel very thick or sturdy. I don't know if you can get autographs out of these. Maybe. No, 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 no. I don't see a back to the card. Is that a good thing? Holy smoke. Is that some cool? Oh, it's just protected. <laughs> that does look cool, though. Is that one of the originals? Holy shit! Check this out. 2019 original artwork, Andrew McCutcheon, artist Carlos Caballero. Fantastic artist. That is the original. It's all jacked up. I don't know if I can clean that up, but it doesn't matter because that's part of the art, right? Like, that's holy shit. <laughs> That is fucking awesome. Um, I wish I had something cool to put that in. I might not. Let's see. Oh, I can make do. Yeah, I can make do. Might be a little big, but it's a lot <clears throat> I thought I've seen a couple of these open. And you can see the card back, right, when you open it. I got an original artwork. As an artist, I will tell you what, I appreciate this a lot. Huh. That is cool. I can never, I like to collect artwork cards. That's why I'm buying this. As a baseball card collector and an artist, I like artwork cards. <laughs> um, but I usually can't afford to actually go for the one-on-one -on -one sketch cards that I myself do. <laughs> so I love a, a set like this, gallery, where I uh, can get the cool artwork and it's, you know, fairly cheap on the base cards. Or like museum canvas. Sorry, I'm just going to stare at this for a while. <laughs> that is freaking cool. It's super smudgy down here. I don't know what's up with that. But, you know, I'll figure it out. I've got an eraser. <laughs> so, that's cool. I'm glad I'm recording this. 
I'm sure Carlos will see it. Let's dig into the regular pack. Let's see how we do after. So we already won, right? <sighs> Alright, we got Chris Sale by Todd Aaron Smith. I'll try and give due credit to all the artists here. Austin Riley Rookie is pretty sweet by Josh Trout. He's, I think Josh Trout is pretty new to the sketch card game, but a very, very talented artist. You wouldn't know it by his art. Schwarber, Dan Bergren, not new at all, and definitely one of the best in the game. Master and Apprentice, uh, this is uh, John Jim Caspro. Hope I'm saying his name right. I gave him a compliment, or I I watched a couple videos of people opening these, and both of them really seem to dig the Master and Apprentice. So I told him that. I said, I think you're. Your cards are really being appreciated in these. Ooh, can't catch my breath. I'm super pumped. <laughs> Trent Thornton rookie card. This is going to be one of those where most of the cards go in the keeper pile instead of the commons pile. Because there's so many rookies, so many parallels, inserts. Kaboom. Kaboom. Keyboom. I'm not actually sure how to say it. Todd Aaron Smith. Anthony Rizzo. There's, I think, six artists. That's John Jim Casper, who also did the Master and Apprentice. Trout by Trout. That makes sense. Stewart. Ah, oh, should have been Stewart. <laughs> Kevin Graham. Here we go. Sorry, I'm going to skip that one for a sec. Eat Phil Meyer by Carlos Caballero. My buddy who did an original for me. Featured artists. So we got John Gian Caspro, Kevin Graham, Mayumi Sato. Very talented. I'm hoping one day I get a card like that with my, my silly mug on it. Maybe next year. So good for them. Oh, here we go. We got a winner. We got a Pete Alonzo rookie card on the back. That's sweet. It's coming well. Reese McGuire by Kevin Graham. Michael Kopech by Kevin Graham. Keston Hura. That's a keeper. That's a penny sleever. Oh, and there's my first auto. Ooh, it's a, not, not a big auto. Jan Caspro, let's see. I'm wondering if there's any artists I've missed. Let's see, there's my first auto. Jacob Nix is not the autograph you want, but there's a Pete Alonzo that's pretty sweet. So let's hope my next auto is a better one. But, like I said, boy, it's hard to complain about anything that comes out of this box after getting an original artwork in the box. And it's funny that I was like, oh, we'll do the box topper first. Those are always boring. Not this time. That might be the coolest card I've ever pulled from a pack. Mike Clevenger. Luis Arias. Oh. Surprise. I feel like um, Filmington just suggested that he's a guy to watch for. Altuve by Trout, a Babe Ruth, Masters, Gian Caspero, and Carson Kelly by Dan Berggren. Uh, I think if I've missed any artists at this point, it's because they're doing insert only. Stuff. I think we've got at least one card by all of the main base card artists. That was a Berrios. Matt Chapman. Ponce de Leon rookie card. A little background action there. The uh, field there. There's a Juan Soto. 
Heritage. So who did the Heritage, does it say? Louise Draper. Okay. So there's a different artist. So I don't think she did base cards. She probably did all of the Heritage cards, which is really cool. I wonder, I read the odds. I wonder what the odds are to get an original box topper. It's got to be pretty astronomical. The Cole Tucker. Rookie. It's a nice one. Droya. There's my another my another autograph. My next autograph. Nikki Lopez. So my autographs left something to be desired. But I got both autographs were rookie cards. So you never know if they're gonna pan out. Um, neither were numbered. Maybe I'll find a numbered card or two in the rest of the box. Here. KB, Chris Bryant, Tatis, okay, well, that's right, there's still plenty of rookies I could be looking for, we got Alonzo, we got Tatis, we could still get Vlad, we could still get Eloy, the Tatis was bun done by Josh Trout, really nice, I don't know what's up with Tatis always getting uh, a landscape card, another master apprentice, there's Eloy, with uh, a big hurt. And there's a private issue, Framber Valdez. So that's, I guess that's a parallel, probably numbered. Numbered to 250. So that's cool, but when you get the parallel, you want those to be your big rookies, of course. Say his name, Fulton Avich. I'll go with that, Taylor Ward. Trey Mancini. Mariano Rivera, Masterpiece. Masterpiece is pretty nice. Kevin Graham. And then JD Hammer. Cool. Let's see. Well, I got my two autos and I got an original. What could I still hope for? Maybe a really low numbered card? Is there anything in this that's really low, low numbered? Out of one of ones or out of ten or something? Foley, I don't even know who that is. Mullins, there's some oddball rookies in here. There's, there was my autograph. Sandy Koufax, Hall of Famer. That's pretty cool. By Dan Berggren. Dan Bergeron is a really good artist. He's probably, I feel like maybe in baseball, he's like the elite. Um, in that he's been doing the canvas collections since before I was doing them, I believe. And I've been doing them since, I think, 2013. All right, we got Xander Bogarts. We got a Yastrzemski. Yes. We got Shane. Call me Justin. Let's see if we call him Justin on the back. No. That's too bad. <laughs> Jackie Robinson is a master. And a studio. This is a great break. I'm not going to be able to afford too many of these. Uh... I don't know if they come this year in the blaster boxes or not, but these master boxes or whatever they're called with two autos, yeah, I'm not going to be able to afford many of those. I'll put it on my Christmas list. That's it. We got Bregman. I like Bregman. He's a, I feel like he's an underrated player. Ooh, that's a nice heritage. Mike, Mike Trout. Very 
Okay, cool. And Chance Adams. All right, I still got quite a stack of packs here. Aaron Judge. Aaron Nola. Steven Dugar. Another master and apprentice, Babe and Judge. And a Blake Snow. Let's see, let's see Vlad. Gold Eagle Schmidt. Castellanos. Nate Lowe. Colby Allard, there's another parallel. Number two fifty. All right, Will Smith. Is this the catcher, Will Will Smith, or the pitcher? This is the catcher. He's the rookie. Uh, Colby Allard. Good rookie pack. A lot of rookies. Oh, that's not a rookie. Cal Jr. Well, this is fun stuff, you guys. What do you think I... You think I got a shot at a one-on-one -on -one sketch card, too? Is that asking too much after already getting an original art card? Tuki Toussaint, Juan Soto. I always like these, so this is one of those things I can notice as an artist. There's a lot of cool photos of baseball players where you can see their reflection in their sunglasses, and I like to pick those to draw. They always turn out pretty cool looking. So that's a nice choice by uh, Kevin Graham there. There's Granky. I believe the original artwork on this one was probably a little bit larger, and they maybe cropped in on it. Just a guess. Clayton Kershaw. Danny Jansen. Five packs left to hit a monster. Still waiting for something good out of this box. Trevor Bauer, Estrada rookie, Verlander, another master and apprentice, Ted Williams and Mookie, yep, and Whit Merrifield. Muncie, Buxton. Gary Sanchez, Bregman Masterpiece, and J.K. Alright, let's finish strong. Let's finish with a nice hit. Something fun and exciting. Well, this is cool. That one. All right, we got Buster Posey, Matt Carpenter, Christy Mathewson Hall of Fame, Chris Davis. So that's cool. So here we go. You get to compare. So there's the original. It's about a four by six, I would say, maybe a little bit smaller, three and a half by five and a half or so. And they use pretty much the whole art on the card, so that's awesome. You can see slight differences. They kind of, the background was more blue. I was just curious about that. Um, yeah, that's pretty rad. Uh, all right, two packs left. Awesome. 
Austin Meadows. Dang it. Dang it. That well Lugo. Duplantier. Ernie Banks. And a Jeff McNeil is a pretty nice rookie. Last pack. Simber. Merrill Kelly. Heritage Chris Davis. There we go. Eloise Draper. So, <laughs> all right. So the there we go is I knew there was one artist we were missing. Impressionists. Matt Stewart. With a beautiful Juan Soto. That's really nice. Um, so I think we covered all the artists. I didn't get the other artist's card. I'm, I'm not, there's not too many people who are looking forward to the artist cards. Sorry, artists. Um, but I would have. <laughs> so I'm sure I'll still, like I said, I probably won't buy a ton of these. Put it on my Christmas list. But I'll, I'll end up getting enough that I, I feel confident I'll get that other card too. That had the artists who were not on the first card. But that was an incredibly fun break, you guys. Now, it started really strong, so that helped. But that, I'm trying to think. I've opened a couple packs before with sketch cards, um, including one of my own out of the UFC product. But that is pretty freaking cool. Original artwork, Andrew McCutcheon, the Carlos Caballero. All right, hope you guys enjoyed that. That was 2019 Gallery. Go out and buy some. Support the artists. You guys, here's the thing about this that a lot of people overlook. You know, you're all collectors. Nobody, you know, everybody's more worried about who the baseball player is on the, on the card or whatever, if you got the guys from your favorite team or the guys that you PC or whatever. But if you like these cards and if you like the artwork on these, if something jumps out at you as like being, oh man, this, this card looks really cool, this artist is really talented, contact the artist. We're all pretty easy to find on Facebook or whatever your social media of choice, and I guarantee you that everybody who is an artist on this set would be really happy to do a commission of your favorite player, your favorite athlete, your favorite celebrity, your favorite whatever. Um... That's how we get by doing this. Like, that's how we make a living. And so, if you like these cards, support the artists, reach out to them, buy art directly from them, or even just say, hey, man, I pulled one of your cards and it was awesome. That's really cool. So, we love to hear that kind of thing. <laughs> so, anyway, that was a really awesome break. I'm super pumped to get an original artwork out of that. Uh, that was one of the coolest pulls of my life. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm Brad U.